Hey y'all, this is the Kobe Bryant Film Room. Welcome to the Behind the Bench Sports Network, where you get your basketball content, football content, and other sports news. Right? Shout out to Rashad, Big Dog, Kelvin, Jacoby, and uh, many others, man, you'll get on this channel, man, as we continue to grow and we continue to build. I hope you guys enjoy the video. Peace. Check out what I said yesterday regarding uh, the bad officiating with the Lakers versus the Toronto Raptors. Check out what I said yesterday, and we will come right back here and break it down. This is about what you see with your own eyes. Are you going to go back and watch the game? Are you going to believe what you see, or, what you go, or, or, or are you going to believe what you hear? Because I'm pretty sure there's going to be a cleanup job on ESPN or Fox Sports about this game. Or are they just going to ignore it and say, great win by the Lakers? You know how they operate. So, yesterday I did a video, right? The video was called, They're Going to Make LeBron the Goat, Whether You Like It or Not, Part 1. Now, why did I label it part one? I could have just left everything where it was at yesterday, right? Label it part one because I know or knew, I knew what they were going to do. They can't help themselves. I knew what they were going to do. They were going to try and control the narrative, right? ESPN, Fox Sports, they're going to try to control the narrative, right? Right? This video right here is part two. I told you so. Right? And so I want, I want you to understand something. I want you, to, you guys to understand something. They know they're not going to get everybody to believe this stuff. Right? In fact, the rational man, the reasonable man is not. Right? There's too, much, there's too many facts against it. Right? But... But the gullible person, right, is going to eat this type of stuff up. The gullible person, the person who believes everything they're told is going to eat this up. Right? They're going to eat it up. They're going to love it. They're going to be like, you see, bro, right after ESPN did a video, right? These dudes started repeating the thing, the very same thing Stephen A said just started saying in the in the comment section. I said, dude, you're literally repeating what this man said verbatim. Oh, well, look, down the stretch of the games, they were they intentionally foul. No, it, bro, duh. They were behind. Duh. Like, come on, bro. Like, let's be real. Be real, bro. Come on now. Be real, bro. What do you see on the footage? What do you see? You see physical contact, no call. You see flop, call. That's what you see. That's what you see if you have two eyes. What you see, you can't, listen, you can't justify the free throws, bro. And, the, and listen, I had this one guy say, well, free throws, you know what I'm saying? If you look at other games, blah, 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 blah. I'm like, yo, don't insult our intelligence, bro. If you watch other games, there, there may be blown calls right here and there. We're talking about consistently, bro, in one game. Like, we just talk, like, what we talking about, bro, is we talking about manipulation, non-calls. We're not just talking about free throws. We're talking about things they don't call. Not everything don't happen. Every, every thing that mess, that's messed up when it comes to officiating, don't show up at the free throw line, bro. You might get held, right? There might be a moving screen. You ain't gonna get free throws for that. 
right? Things that you have to challenge because of BS. Like, come on, bro. That dictates the whole game. But I have to go back and review a BS call just to get the BS call overturned. And then it doesn't get overturned and I get a call. I, I lose a timeout. Come on, bro. Yes, that's going to affect you. Yes. But y'all don't see it, huh? Or do you not want to see it? Do you not want to see it? And I think it's more of that. I think it's confirmation bias. I think you guys want to tune in to a show that's going to confirm what you already want to believe. That's what I think it is. Because you're not being fair. Had LeBron came out and balled out, right? I would have came out here and did a video. Actually, I tried to do a video when the Lakers beat the Clippers. I tried to do a video. It got copyrighted. I had took it down. But I had that video with the works to give LeBron a little bit of credit. Give him some credit. Even though I felt like there was some bad officiating that game too. But I said, you know what? You can't, can't crap on the guy all the time. And you got to be fair. So I was like, shoot, I'm do, you know, trying to give him his props, whatever the case may be. Had to take the video down. I got copyrighted. The NBA picks and chooses what they want to, what they want to let you record, right? So I took it down. So, but I mean, like, bro, use your eyes, bro. I knew what they were going to do. They play damage control. Bro, that's like, it's almost like, you know that homeboy that you got? You keep telling him that his girl cheating on him? Man, nah, man, she'll never do that to me. And you're like, bro, I seen them. I seen them at the movies. I seen them walking down the street together. And they were holding hands. And they were tongue kissing. Oh, no, nah, man, not her, man. You know what she told me? She told me she was at home. Like, bro, why would you go to the source? Why would you go to the person doing this to you? What do you think you're going to get from them? What do you think she's going to say? Oh, yeah, you got me. Come on, bro. Let's be adults, bro. Like, like yo, like, this is all I ask, right? Let's be adults about this, man. Let's be adults. This is ridiculous that we talk to grown men sometimes and they just don't understand. Hey, were you, were you out with such and such at this time? Nah, man, I was at the house. And I show you pictures. I said, yo, this her right here. This him in the front. This her right there. They walking down the street holding hands. Oh, man, that's, they just cool. They like, come on, bro. Like. You still, like, even after you've shown all the evidence, everything that you need to know, oh, they just cool. This like, this like dealing with these guys, bro. This is just like dealing with a friend who got a girl who cheating on them. And then they get mad at you. What, what's the next thing they do, fellas? They get mad at you. Man, you need to stay out of our business, man. This is, this is me and her, man. I love her. I'm about to get married to her. Hey, you like, whatever, bro. Because for some reason, they think us telling them this information is going to hurt us. We trying to help y'all. We trying to help y'all. We do this for y'all, to free y'all. Why wouldn't you want to know if this girl cheating on you? So that you can make a decision. You can stay with her if you want. We just let you know what she doing. Right? They don't want they don't they don't even want to know what she's doing, dog. And it's all good. Now I equate that to what's going on with these dudes when they just keep seeing the same theme over and over again. The Lakers hit that 13th spot in the West, dog. The damn bottom of the bottom. LeBron sits out. Do you think the Lakers are that much better without LeBron? LeBron sits out, right? 
all the free throws. Now you get the historic amount of free throws. Now the whole season doesn't matter. Now it's a different year. It, it, it's literally a completely different ball game as far as officiating. Come on, man. Come on, bro. Then we get to the playoffs against the Warriors. Oh, uh, what the media say? Oh, they a jump shot shooting team. Lies. They are a jump shot shooting team, but they drove to the basket a lot too. Lies, yo. Lies. And you seen it with your eyes. You seen it with your eyes. You saw it. Yo, this is crazy, bro. This is crazy that we dealing with people and they run right back to the people lying to them. We, I don't get paid, bro. We don't, we don't, hopefully this channel gets monetized very soon, but we're not getting millions and millions of dollars by a corporate machine to lie to y'all. Right? You could check out my personal channel. My, my stuff would never get monetized. Just you look at the YouTube guidelines and check out my channel, the Kobe Bryant Film Room. And like and subscribe, by the way. But go check out that channel. That stuff's not getting monetized. And I know it. I didn't do it for the money. All these other guys, million dollar contracts, TV deals. Right? What do you think they're going to do for the NBA? If, they, if the NBA doing what they're doing, what you think these people finna say? They make money off the game. Are you serious? Are you serious, bro? You go back to the people who shaking you down? <laughs> for, the, for the answers? Man, we in trouble as a society, bro. That's like going to the politicians who didn't do their job when they were elected, going back to them and asking them for more, more shit. Like it's, it, it, like, it's just crazy. It's crazy, yo. And this is how politicians get over on people. They don't understand the game. And you have to break it down to them. To understand game, hey, yo, you know, of course she's going to lie to you, bro. Yes, she was with him. But she told me, but this is what she said. Like, bro, are you serious? <laughs> hey, yo, put in the comment section, yo. If you had a friend like that, yo, that you tried to tell them about a girl and that just the dude just loses all sorts of common sense. But when it comes to everybody else's business, he he know what he's talking about. He very smart now. He could give great relationship advice. You know what I'm saying? These dudes are a trip, man. <laughs> but I don't want to make this video too long. But I knew what they were going to do. Damage control. I knew what they were going to do. And people started doing the math in the comment section. It was like, yo, wait a minute. What he said ain't even adding up. Like, come on, bro. Come on, bro. Do we really? I don't even have to go to my fingers to do math, bro. On this type of stuff. Like it's ridiculous. I mean just. just Guys. Just be fair man. Just be fair. You already screwed the guys. Out of a win. Just at least admit it. Don't be a scumbag bro. At least admit what happened. And you can, and you can move on from that. And maybe the next game. The Lakers go on the run. And they probably win the next game. Fair and square. But that one, hell no. And, and hopefully, we can watch LeBron. LeBron could go on to win a championship. And we won't even have this conversation because he'll win the championship fair and square. And we won't even have, we'll give him his props. It won't be no referee. As long as there's no referee monkey business, I'll come on here on the same platform and give him his respect. Now, I ain't going to call him the king. I ain't going to do what y'all do and call him the king and bow down and wear goat masks and all that stuff. But I give him his credit. I give him what's due to him. I'm, I'm, I'm going to be fair. 
you ball out, you ball out. If you don't, you don't. This is the Kobe Bryant film room, man. And I'm out. Peace.